I am super excited because I will be Hello everyone, it's Monte and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video, I am super excited because I will be taking my first, basically first, but my second italki lesson um, for French. So I am super excited to show you guys that. And also, just a little disclaimer, this is not in any way, shape or form like a sponsored video for my italki. No, this is just like my own opinion. And so I will be showing you guys like all of the experience like taking the lesson and speaking in it and then after that giving you guys like my overall review of italki from the past two lessons that i've had and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video so let's get started hello everyone good morning it's monse and today is thursday july 14th and today is actually going to be my first well I already had one italki lesson, however today is going to be my second italki lesson and I decided to record it for you guys today because italki is like a language learning app and so today is going to be my first italki lesson for French and I'm so excited, however last week I had my actual first italki lesson but for Italian and I didn't record that because, I don't know, it was kind of just like my first lesson and I really wasn't sure how it was going to go so today I will be recording my first italki lesson for French and I'm so excited so at the end I will just be like giving you guys my overall like opinion about italki even though it's just going to be two lessons I want to give like share with you guys like what I think about it but yeah guys, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Sorry, it's 6.10 in the morning and I'm still kind of tired. So that's why my face is a little, you know, still, I'm still not completely woken up. And yeah, let's get ready for the meeting. It's at 6.30 and currently it's, let me check. So it's currently 6.17 in the morning and my meeting is in 10 minutes. So yeah, let's just get on to Zoom because that's where my meeting is going to be. Okay guys, so since this meeting is going to be through Zoom, um, I already have the waiting screen on. So this is the waiting screen. Please wait for the host to start the meeting. And yeah guys, I'm a little bit nervous, I'm not going to lie, it's a little bit nerve-wracking, but I feel like I'm going to do much better in French because my first time when I did it in Italian, that was nerve-wracking because I still can't really speak that much Italian, and so my teacher was speaking to me kind of like I knew Italian, and it was just kind of a little messy. And guys, it's 6.28 and it's almost going to start. I'm excited, but I'm a little nervous at the same time. Hi. Hello. How are you? I'm very good, thank you. How are you? Hi. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Um, well, people normally say like salut or bonjour. Or okay. yeah, they say like bonjour, mais, like good day, like that. Can you introduce yourself in, in French? Yeah, like my name and how old I am? Yes. Um, bonjour, je m'appelle Monse. Um, j'ai 16 ans et ouais. j'habite dans les États-Unis. Qu'est-ce que tu peux me dire de plus? Uh, j'aime beaucoup danser, j'aime beaucoup cuisiner pour mon famille et oui. Alors, ma question c'est quelle danse pratique tu J'aime beaucoup danser avec la musique de K-pop. J'aime beaucoup ça. <rire> Quel est ton plat préféré Pour cuisiner J'aime beaucoup manger les salades. 
avec le, les fruits et les végétales. J'aime beaucoup les végétales et les fruits. my French italki lesson and I'm not gonna lie it went really good like I think I at times I was like stuttering a tiny little bit if you guys saw in the last clip but I think I did pretty good um after I stopped recording I talked even more in French um so I think that was really good but I am super super happy that I took this lesson uh honestly I'm not going to lie I think it went a little bit better um this my french lesson than my italian lesson however i still think both of them i think i learned but right now um i'm just going to be giving you guys my overall review of what i think about italki and the little can i speak the lessons there so yeah okay guys so personally I, from the last two lessons that I've had, I really do enjoy italki. First of all, because you get to speak to native speakers like italki, and here I'll show you on the screen. They give you options if you would like to um, have professional teachers as for them to teach you, or community tutors, and there's just like native speakers who are more focused on just like speaking. Personally, for Italian and French, I chose professional teachers. I decided to choose a professional teacher because I thought it was more, they would be able to like help me better and they would know how to explain things better. But yeah, personally for that like category, like I talk you letting you choose what kind of teachers you would like, I think it's really good. Also, not talking about like the price, I think I talk you is not expensive at all like depending um because here i'll show you again they give you a variety of teachers for each language and they give you like price options like each teacher has their own prices and like prices for different lessons and i think that is really good because some people may not be able might not have like the ability to pay that much for a class and anyways like so many of the teachers like don't ask for a lot of money and they're still really good like i think that is such a good thing now as to like how the teachers are depending on the teachers each teacher is different and their the way of teaching is very different i'm going to be honest with you guys um i feel like my french teacher the way she started off the class um it was more of like getting to know me and like what we were able to work on i personally like the way she did it better um then italian and i'm not saying that my italian teacher was bad all i'm saying is that i felt a bit more comfortable because um her personality was a bit more outgoing and that made me feel comfortable as well and also the way she like started off the class was just like writing everything that i knew in french however my italian teacher i really liked her however i feel like she was a little bit shy it was kind of a little awkward sometimes but also the way she started off the class it was just teaching me it wasn't really like getting to know my Italian level. And so I feel like that could have been a bit different. But every teacher has their own style. And I'm not saying that my Italian teacher was bad. I'm just saying that I think each teacher has their own way of teaching. And also, going on to my next point, italki has their own like free trials. So you can try, and they're way cheaper. It's like two, three, four dollars for trial lessons depending on the teacher again and trial lessons are basically you get to try out that class like that teacher for 30 minutes and that's what i did for italian and for french that's what trial lessons are for it's for you to kind of meet the teacher and if you're not really comfortable with them you can try another trial lesson with 
another teacher so yeah guys that is kind of my like overall review of italki i really really like it i think it's so helpful um for you to kind of meet new people but also learn more um and because my teachers were both native speakers i think that's also really good because you know when you learn a language you want to learn kind of like how natives speak it right and so i think it's a good idea to speak to those native speakers and kind of have them teach you how native speakers talk like in that country and so i think that's just really good and such a good opportunity for you to like also advance more and just the language in general let me know in the comments if you guys want to see more of these videos thank you guys so much for watching again this video um remember to like and subscribe and see you next time bye guys